All right, my friends, it's Hank back with another episode. Picking up where we left off, right here in the glowing sea. I did um, take a refreshing beverage um, just before I started the stream so I could get my rad countdown. Need to kind of be heading in this direction, so I'm going to try and head up through either over this hill or um, up through this pass. Let's try this pass. Claw there on the horizon. And I'm going to use the 50 to bring him down so I can save a rocket. Whoa, whoa. You hear that? Man, that fucking thing is quick. I've never seen anything like it. Um, I think five or six ranks in riflemen in that 50 caliber with incendiaries. It might even be a two shot. Let's just uh, take a quick look here to just demonstrate the power of that rifle. Yeah, it's a two shot. So, uh, with, I think. Um, Six ranks and riflemen with better perks improved or better perks enhanced by Z. It's been a while since I've looked at it. So yeah. Save a rocket or two, because I might need them. I'm down to like maybe six. And that's including what dog meets carrying. Keep checking my map here. Should we get close? Let's follow this little trail over here. Switch to some grenades. Let's go with plasmas for a while. Plasmas have a, a kind of a lower throwing arc. It's kind of hard to get them a further distance. Looking for any kind of landmark that might, uh... uh his children are at and did tell me that he was living in a cave, so... Kind of thinking that this might be it. Certainly looks like a good place to try. Now, they did mention he didn't want to be uh, found by anybody, so I suspect that I might have to watch for mines. Or other types of traps. I'll take what care I can.
belly is, of course, the uh, unarmored weak part of the Death Claw. And better locational damage. Fifty caliber is the only um, round that can headshot a uh, death claw. All right, I guess this is the place. Take my rad suit off. Get the cowboy hat back on. Take a glowing blood pack. A little more Radex and have some water. Fucking parasites. Shit. <laughs> Hopefully these don't dehydrate the shit out of me. That's nah, alright. Shotgun. Hopefully we can have a very pleasant conversation here. We never met this son of a bitch before. Yo. Okay, you're gonna have to leave that fucking power armor something. behind. I need you to get out. You got it. Make more fucking noise. Heads up. Over here. Wait there. Perfect. I'm gonna just go ahead and pulse this cannon here. Switch to five five six instead of seven six two. Give me that advantage of having a suppressed weapon. Keep an eye out for mines. Son of a bitch, isn't he? Excuse me. Hold it. Take it nice and slow. No sun moves. I know you're from the Institute. Where's Kellogg? Huh? Trying to sneak up on me while you distract me? It's not going to work. I'm not stupid. I knew they'd send him after me. Kellogg's on the bottom of my fucking boot. Take it easy. Kellogg's dead. Dead. He's dead. Don't you lie to me. I'm not lying. I killed him myself. I enjoyed it. Kellogg was ruthless. There's a reason the Institute used him to do their dirty work for so many years. 
I knew they'd send him after me. Tried to prepare for it. But I still wasn't sure I'd make it. And so you... You killed him, eh? Well, what do you want with me? Looking for my boy. Why did you leave the Institute? I know you came from there. You know about the escape? But how? No. It doesn't matter. I'm not going back. I can't go back. Look at me! Why are you even here? What do you want? I want my boy. I need whatever information you've got. Anything to help me get into the Institute. I'm sorry, what? You want to get into the Institute? Are you insane? Never mind how nearly impossible that is. Even if you were to succeed, it'd almost certainly end in your immediate death. What reason could you possibly have for taking that kind of risk? Number one, my boy. Number two, I am that crazy son bitch. It... it doesn't matter. Fine. You know what? I don't even want to know. You want to get yourself killed is your problem. But I'm telling you, that's what's going to happen. I can help you get in there. But I want something in return. Everybody does. My pleasure. You help me and I'll help you. All right. If I help you, you're going to do something for me. Before I was forced to leave, I was working on a serum to reverse this mutation. It could return me to normal. You understand? So if you get in there, I need you to find it in my old office and bring it to me. I think that's pretty reasonable in exchange for helping you. All right, let's talk details. First things first. You know how synths get in and out of the Institute? Not a fucking clue. Not really, no. Almost no one on the surface does, and that's on purpose. They like to keep it a secret. It's commonly referred to as the molecular relay. I don't understand all the science behind it, but it works. Dematerializes you in one place, rematerializes you in another. I'm sure it sounds crazy, but it's a reality. No, the man. relay is the only way in and out of the Institute. You understand? The only one. Yeah, that Star Trek. You're going to have to use it. Now, have you ever seen an Institute courser? Yes, I have. Well, not lots of them, but... I've seen one. A courser? What's that? Another Institute secret. Coursers are Institute synths, designed for one purpose. They're hunters. Operations go wrong, a synth goes missing, and a courser is dispatched. They're very good at what they do, and you're going to have to kill one. All right. Let's go. Just point me in the right direction. Well, I suppose your enthusiasm counts for something. Every courser has special hardware that gives them a direct connection to the relay in the Institute. It's embedded in a chip in their heads. You need that chip. But to get it, You'll have to find a courser. Now, I don't know exactly where you can find one. They haven't sent any after me. And sitting here waiting doesn't seem like a good plan. You're going to have to hunt one down. I can tell you where to start and give you some help finding one. But you'll have to do the dirty work. I fucking love ripping the shit out of people's heads. Okay, let's get to work. Right. The primary insertion point for coursers is in the ruins of CIT, directly above the Institute. So you'll want to head there. Now, the relay causes some pretty heavy interference all across the EM spectrum. You've got a radio on that pit boy, right? When you get to the ruins, tune into the lower end of the band and listen in. You'll be able to hear the interference. Follow the signal. And it'll lead you to a courser. Then you just have to not get killed. Not gonna lie. 
The odds aren't in your favor here. But if you do make it, remember what I said about the serum. I need it badly. I... I really do hope you find what you're looking for. I got your back, you ugly bastard. Oh, are you kidding me? It stinks in here. <laughs> I'd like to steal from him, but I'm not going to do it. Let's just take a look around here. Excellent. Oh, Raven, that's worth our time. Oh, definitely, Kate. Definitely. Fat finger in that keyboard, huh? Poor bastard. see anything else of any particular interest in here. Let's cook up some of these drugs while I'm here. Need antiseptic. Oh well. alive. Come on. Okay. We'll just have to huff it the fuck out of this shitty ass flowing sea. That's going to be the objective now. Just make a beeline. I think I'm going to try and head for Somerville first to rest up. We'll just see how it goes, how it plays. Let's go with uh, Deathclaw Stew, and I think I'd like to have Ragstag Stew. We'll go with Tipsy Brahmin, something to get us with as much endurance as fast and as far as possible. Brahmin Stew would be the second behind that, but I don't know how much I have to spare. So. All right, Kate, you can take this alive. armor back yeah. for the time being. Yep, I got it. If she doesn't take it, whatever. It's really no big sweat off my balls. All right, let's get a direction, pick a landmark, and the fuck on. going for that. Let's 
As soon as my AP gets low, I'm going to hit the omelet. Surprised that I haven't had any stalkers or random encounters pop up on me. But generally, when I say some shit like that, that's when it pops off. to Kate. I'm not even going to worry about that meat. It's a wild ass pyramid here. Kind of gives me the willies. But seems fun. I think uh, just the bizarre nature of whatever the fuck this thing is being like one of the pyramids of Giza having this giant bomb and this crater thing out in this crate out here that's just too much for my uh, pea brain curiosity not to want to investigate despite the fact that it's probably super fucking dangerous Yeah, let's do it. Could be the end of me, but... Definitely looks unwise. But I'm gonna do it anyway. seem to be irradiated in here. That's a good thing. We'll switch to 762. Got the shotgun. Load up the 40 millimeter. It's good on the inside. We'll go with the um, G36. Shut that damn alarm off. This doesn't go well, not at all. I'm gonna agree with you, Kate. This looks fucked up. of fucked up this might be I'm not sure at all which is almost my favorite kind of fucked up
There's got to be a way to shut this damn alarm off. Nice. What you reading there? A little radiation resistance there, Kate. Why would I open that blast door? Probably because there'd be some giant fucking robot. So let's get eyes on it before we um, just go opening doors willy-nilly. It's kind of the way I roll. I like to see it first. Looks clear. I'll open it. Hold position. I feel like I feel like I hear something stomping around, but that damn alarm, I can't really be too sure. Obviously, still having issues integrating the Mark 28 nuclear bomb with our existing ICBMs. Most likely to do with the transitional coupler not latching correctly. Let me check with maintenance. Sounds like ghouls. Whatever the fuck this thing is. I know you're down there, you little rat fink weirdo, little fucking... Beastie. Ahem. What's the matter? Nothing. That was all. Point by. Hey, moving out. Sure, sure. Just keep your shirt on. That's asking a bit much, Kate. You know me better than that. I'm just waiting for the other shoe to drop. better than 
and getting pissed is picking a fight. Am I right? Ah, uh, yeah. One of the many things we agree on, Kate. Alright, pod beta. Bad news is we called irreparable damage to all the Mark 28s using the test. The good news, we have an endless supply in the munitions depot. Where do we get these things? I don't know why it's so important to keep these blast doors closed. But I'm going to do it anyway. Anybody had any friggin' suggestions on how to shut that damn alarm off? Something isn't right. We should get out of here. Ah, oh, relax, Kate. That's not the first time you've said that. drop down in there, I'm not going to be able to get out easily. Just to make sure. Need antiseptic. been too easy so far. Awesome. Now I can at least hear what the fuck is going on in here. How you doing, buddy? Hey, boy. Think you can find something for me? Any bad guys around, buddy? That's just friggin' lovely. No antiseptic there. I mean, it's not that big of a deal, but it's it would be nice to have.
Now, I believe this is a 30 round magazine. Check my HUD real quick. Now it's a 40. Like I mentioned in the previous episode, the disease rates are up. From 1 to uh, 2.15. Got the fucking thing rigged to an explosive. I have no idea what I'm doing down here. Take any chances. You're gonna drag that junk around. Yeah, Kate, I need water wherever I can get it. You're hey. up. This better be worth it. You think you can unlock that? I'm on it, Captain. That was easy. Have a challenge next time. I didn't think you'd have a problem with it, Kate. This is a place to sleep, and I am fairly exhausted, but I don't want to, um... 
lose all my stat buffs. So I'm just going to push on. But it is nice to know there is a place to sleep. Done, Kate. You know, I kept you around for something. Other than your good looks, excellent aim. Awesome dialogue. Badass attitude. Your love of drugs and liquor. I mean, really. This has got to be a bug. What the fuck am I doing down here? I really don't know. This couldn't possibly be right. That's it's got to be a bug with the barrels down here. I'm gonna be pissed if I get soaked. He 
easy there with the close range grenades, Kate. You don't fucking mind. Especially around all these nuclear fucking bombs. If you didn't notice. make my life easy here heads up move here heads up here Will do. look alive head over there damn look it. alive stay there it's kind of under the impression that maybe that nuke would get sent up the Lift. I'm gonna try it again. And if it doesn't go up, it doesn't go up. I'll just go up with it. This entire um, complex is buggy. I'll get it done. On me. You know, anybody could leave me a comment as to whether hey. or not I'm on it, Captain. Go there. No problem. that this uh, complex hey. is just kind of like traditionally buggy. There. Or, um, it's something I'm going to have to go back and um, debug as a possibility. It's one of my mods. I've never, ever run into any series of bugs like this before. What the fuck was this place all about? Was there some shit in here I missed? I don't know. Leave me a comment.
if uh, anybody has any idea, I'm not going to waste a whole lot of time with it, but it, I do find it kind of intriguing. I'm gonna have to have to find some cover or I am so fucked. There they are. Seven six two over this range. Get that Gatling rifle up. Get the Typhoon up. Holy shit. Cretans were waiting to ambush me. Waste some fifty on the shitheads, but
through a live save temp say that was all the friggin uh ambush shits I kind of expected to get over time. I mean, is there a reason that I'm up here? I have access to something special? I guess not. I, I'm friggin' clueless about this site. Like I say, if anybody uh, has any idea what it's about, or if there's something uh, particular about that area that deserves some investigation, I'll maybe check it out later. I just don't want to spend too much more time in the glowing sea than I have to. Looks like a lot of fucking fun. It's been a long time since I've used one of those. Level 96. I never really gave much thought. I've never reached this level before, especially not with Z's. Better perks enhanced. I did take the fourth rank in Action Boy last episode. Lock Blacksmith appeals to me. As well as, um, perhaps, perception. I seem to survive alright, so I'm not going to take toughness. And luck has never really been my, um, never really been my bag. I've never really needed it. I make my own luck. So I'm going to go ahead and just take another rank in perception. Get this uh, scar out, play with it for a minute. Okay. I'm just way the fuck out in no man's land.
something's good. Yes. Just get my critical spilt. What the hell kind of ammo count is on this fucking thing? 30 round magazine? 20 rounds. I gotta really watch how fast it can go through my 308. I'm going to have to end the stream here uh, pretty soon because it's about one hour. I like to keep it to about an hour. All right, you motherfucker. a brood mother I'd say uh, pop out with your cock out but I guess the brood mother doesn't have that kind of problem Is that thing? It's Typhoon. It. Now it's good and pissed off. I think this is probably a pretty wise spot to um, end the stream. It's been Hank. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.